Hello and welcome back to We Who Are About To Die. And uh, we're actually going to be swapping around something right here, because obviously if you think about it, and this is something that I didn't think about before, but if you think about it, if I change this to stamina, I'm going to gain more stamina skill, and then, well, obviously I'm going to go for a sword in the secondary slot. This actually makes a huge deal of sense. I didn't realize this. I thought it was going to train at relatively the same rate, but no, no, no. This is actually much, much better. And you can see here, we're now going to gain 8.1 in stamina skill, which is actually fantastic. So very much looking forward to this. And I'm also going to be training a little bit more here. So we're going to get another five training gears just to make sure, just in case something were to happen. You never know. Anyway, unfortunately, I don't have the ability to heal because of the random event that happened at the end of the previous episode, so there's no need to tell me to, to heal and, and things like that. <laughs> uh, it happens, it happens. Anyway, let's just take a quick look at what I'm currently doing here. So let me see. Yeah, we have a pretty significant amount of weapon, uh, well, shall we say sword, uh, sword skill, but my stamina, as you can see, is not doing very well. So at least now I've learned that, you see. I've learned a little bit more about how we can progress in the future. So, um, yeah, hopefully that's going to work out quite nicely. Now, as far as I'm aware, every single one of these patrons has a... I know someone actually asked me what the difference is. And uh, I, I'm like, well, I, I don't actually know that much about the patrons. I know that um, Aluora is all about influence. So um, possibly gaining more fame. Uh, Joradus is all about training skills. Maza, I'm not entirely sure uh, what she's about, but Valerius is definitely about money. So if you want money, then you're going to have to get on his good side. But uh, yeah, uh, I, I, as I say, this is all very preliminary. I'm not entirely sure about that. Anyway, as you know, if you saw the previous episode, you know that we're currently repairing our sword. I'm not sure if that was really worth it. Probably not, right? Probably not. But I don't actually have any fame anyway to be able to unlock anything else here. So the best thing I can do is move on. I am not full HP, unfortunately, but we can only hope that maybe this next fight is going to be relatively decent. Now, the problem with this, as you might expect, is that I don't have enough fame to be able to reveal anything here. You see? So technically, I can't, I, can't even, I, I wouldn't do this. I, I wouldn't do this because we have no idea what's going on here. So I'm actually going to go for the many versus many. And we're going to see how we do. That's pretty much all I can really bet on here. And I'm not going to do any betting, obviously. I don't have enough money for that. But anyway, let's do it. This is going to be interesting because uh, many versus many. I'm, I'm kind of happy about this because I do have a new sword. The new sword is in my opinion pretty amazing but oh this is a very small okay this is a very small arena i'm a little bit worried about this all things considered very very worried about this but my sword as i say as long as it doesn't get destroyed i should have a pretty decent time here wait a minute many versus many where's my oh there there are my people okay you got you guys go in there first you guys go in there first and uh yeah some people have been really really helpful as well by the way uh about telling me how i can more adequately did my I was disarmed. Are you serious? Give me, give me my, give me my weapon back. Give me my weapon back, please. Are you serious right now? Wow. How did I get disarmed? Okay, I have no idea. But this guy literally dealt so much damage to me now, which was really annoying. But um, yeah, hopefully I'm gonna do okay here. Okay, yeah, that, that. Yeah, let me, let me get out the way. Let me get out the way. This guy is doing a lot of damage. Oh, he lost his arm. Oh no, he didn't lose his arm. What? <laughs> for some reason I thought he lost his arm for a second. That is weird. Okay, wow. Okay, these guys really these guys really mean business, don't they? They are really meaning a huge amount of business. Okay, I'm kind of a bit worried. Okay, that was decent-ish. A uh, decent-ish block as well. I'm going to need to be a bit more careful here. Going to need to eliminate some people. Or at least try to. My stamina is not regenerating as much as I want it to. So I'm going to have to move away from here. Oh my. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh yeah, we got him. Okay, he's dead. He's dead. Okay, let me try and help this guy out. Oh, never. Never mind. Did I just get killed by my own... Did, did, did you see that? Did I get killed by my own guy? 
Okay, well, never mind. Apparently that was much harder than anticipated. That particular fight. I thought to myself, oh, it's a many versus many. It should be fine, but because I was disarmed and I was trying to get my weapon, I took a lot of unnecessary damage. But that's actually okay, because we, as you know, did invest quite a significant amount in our next character. Oh dear. Alright, I'm not looking forward to this actually. Not looking forward to this at all. Okay, so basically... Can I, can I re-roll this guy? Can I re-roll him? Uh, if you abandon this character, you may... Uh, yeah, mm-hmm, yeah. So we can't actually do that. So we're going to have to just take the next character that we have, which is this fellow. I'm not a big fan of this, just purely for the fact that the Skolo takes 50% of all gold. <laughs> oh no, this is terrible. Okay, um, let's see now. Uh... I'm broke, because he obviously has no money. I mean, he's not going to have any money very, very soon, as you can quite clearly tell. But our stamina is a little bit better, at least. And uh, yeah, by the way, you can see the difficulty that we're playing on in the top right there. Someone asked me what difficulty I'm playing on. You can see that every single time we create a character, and I don't change it. Because I, even though I think Commoner is pretty fun, if you want to learn the game, I'm obviously... I have, I have obviously been playing on Gladiator this entire time, which... You know, all things considered, I probably should have started on Commoner just to kind of get a handle on things and how all the mechanics work and everything. But obviously, I'm just jumping into the fire, more like. Anyway, let's see what I can do here. All right, so I have a two-handed. This is... Oh, look at the... Oh, this is terrible. Look at the durability on this thing. The durability is so incredibly terrible. Okay, that is not going to work out too well for me, but okay. Anyway, uh, yeah, let's go and try and train. I'm going to go for stamina and two-handed swords, I suppose. Uh, we're going to go for big intensity here. Big intensity. That's going to cost me six training gear. I guess it's worth it, right? I guess it's worth it. Ten stamina and two-handed swords. I mean, look at that. That's pretty crazy. So, yeah, we're just going to go all out with the training right now. Um, do I want to spend more money, actually? Because I want to make sure that we train every single week. And if I do get a little bit of a random event that prevents us from doing that, that's going to be really, really difficult. So I'm actually just going to go ahead and do that. And then we're going to go in and hopefully just murder whatever it is. Uh, I'm, I'm taking a bit of a risk here, but I'm I'm kind of betting on the fact that maybe we'll be okay. This is a level 4 pit fight, or we could do this, which I think sounds much better, but it is going to be giving us an extremely small amount of money. Mm. I will do the small amount of money, I suppose. Oh, actually, this guy, oh no, I want to I make this guy like us. Should I try it? You know what? Let's go for it. I'm going to I'm going to try it, okay? This is this is not going to work well for me, all right? This is not going to work well for me. I'm going to assume 100% I will die in this first battle. Ooh, this this is cool. Look at that. The arena is actually moving a little bit and it's nighttime. Ooh, very atmospheric. I like it. Anyway, yeah. So as I said, this this two-handed right here is literally just going to get destroyed almost immediately. It only has 18 durability. <laughs> basically one of the worst weapons they could have given me but yeah I'm gonna try and get uh, some damage out here just to get some two-handed skill I suppose and then we'll see what we can do okay that was decent ish damage no don't, no 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 don't don't attack me sir don't attack me uh, you can just leave me alone sir nice <laughs> I'm just doing some random damage Oh, that's my own guy. Oh, I just... Did I just kill my own guy? Hopefully hopefully I didn't. Oh, I decapitated... Well, not decapitated, but I cut the guy in half. What? Oh, that was nice. Oh, that... Oh, this weapon is amazing. I mean, I... Oh, look at that again. Another one. Okay, hello. Okay. What? <laughs> what is happening? We're apparently just murdering every single person that we come across. That's amazing. Okay, I love it. Oh, it broke. Oh, that is sad. Oh, I loved it. 
I love that weapon, even though the durability is terrible. Oh, that was amazing. I loved it. Okay, yeah, I'm just going to pick up this sword now. That's what. That's one of mine, isn't it? Yeah, that's one of mine. And, uh, yeah, we'll just, we'll just be a bit careful here. That's also one of mine. All right, not too bad. I've actually gotten so many kills right now. Look at my look at my audience favor. It's, it's crazy. Okay, very nice. Oh, wow, we just took a massive amount of damage. All right, wait, wait. No, let me run. Okay, there's actually a two-handed over here. Can I pick it up? <gasps> yeah. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, this is going to be good. Maybe. Or not. As the case may be. Oh, he's parrying. He's parrying. Oh, that is not good. Okay. Deflected. Okay, I'm going to have to... I'm going to... Going to get him. I'm going to try and get him. Oh, he, this guy's really... This guy's kind of a beast. This guy's kind of a beast. Uh, I'm not, not a big fan of this guy, <laughs> to be honest. Oh, he's dead. Thank you. Okay. Whew. Now I don't, now I don't have to bother with him. All right. Now we just have to deal with this fellow. Oh, that was some nice damage, though. That was some really, really nice damage. Maybe I can get some more on this. Can we? Oh, never mind. That's a victory. Yes. Okay. Wow. It actually paid off. It actually paid off. Can you believe it? Can you believe it? And we were doing that with um, with intense training as well. So that's really nice. And we do increase Valerius's, uh, you know, percentage right there as well. Look at the amount of fame that we got. That's that's wonderful. That is really, really nice. Okay, so there we go. We recovered a little bit. And, oh, here we go. Okay, I don't have enough money to be able to buy either of these. But these are one-handed maces. These are flails. Oh, dear. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. Okay, uh, they're both the same. They're both the same weapon. That is actually kind of hilarious. Okay, well, I have a decent amount of fame, but I'm thinking what we'll do is we're going to go to the utility menu real fast. I'm going to heal myself very quickly just to make sure that I remember to do that, of course. And then what we're going to do is I'm just going to trade my fame. So we're going to trade 2,000. F That's the thing. I'm not going to have enough, am I? I'm not going to have enough because I have 2,000. If I trade 2,000 fame, I'm going to get, what, around 600 gold, if anything. And that's not going to be enough to get these. So I'm thinking I'm just going to unlock this. I was actually hopeful for a little bit more there. Uh, okay, I'm going to re-roll and we're just going to have to hope. Are you serious right now that they gave me the same one-handed mace? Okay, yeah, I'm not going to have a weapon for this next fight, I assume. Oh, I okay, I do have a weapon, but it's this. Are you serious? <laughs> okay. Gonna have to buy this then. That's that's all I can do. That is literally all I can do. I cannot get anything else. Because as I said to you before, if I traded 2000 fame, you can see exactly what I would have gotten here. I would have gotten between 150 and 300 gold per thousand. And I would have spent 2000. So total, I would have maximum, if I was lucky, I would have gotten 600 gold and I needed 3,200 to be able to purchase the flail and that would have only given me 2,600, uh, uh, you know, as a, as a thing. So it would have been really, really um, kind of sad. It would have been kind of sad. Anyway, I'm just going to train once again. Two-handed swords. No, we're not going to train in two-handed swords. I'm going to train in... Uh, uh, I don't even know what, actually. I guess I will train in one-handed axes because I'm currently using a one-handed axe. I have 28 skill in two-handed swords now. I really wish I had a two-handed... Oh, that is so, so fun. All right, well, uh, let's do a little bit more here. And... Oh, what do I want to do? We probably want to go for another six, don't we? Let's go for another six. Can I can I afford it? Yes, I can. Just about. Okay, nice. All right. So we're full HP. I have this terrible weapon. I mean, it's okay. But yeah, I have this terrible weapon. All right, let's see what we do. Okay, wait a minute, wait a minute. I have enough fame to be able to reveal. So I think I'm probably going to reveal this. This is a one versus one. This is also a one versus one. Let me reveal a bit more about this. Oh my. Uh, okay. Uh, not a big fan. Mm. Oh, okay. Who are we fighting here? Oh, it's it's a civilian. Okay, yeah, sure. Why, why not? Let's let's go with this one. It's a civilian. I, I don't know how good he's going to be, obviously, but let's face it, he's probably going to be better than I am. That's what ha that's what happens, you know. 
that's what happens. But here we go. Oh, we're going into the battle without weapons. Oh, okay. <laughs> so I didn't even need to bother about buying something. Oh, well, never mind. Okay, how, would I, how was I supposed to know, you know? How was I supposed to know that was going to be the case? I, I actually wonder, can you go into... Wait a minute, two-handed sword, two-handed sword? Is there one? Oh, there isn't. There's just a regular sword. Oh, this is a nice one, though. Oh, as you can tell, that was lovely. Oh, it took some damage. Nice. Okay. Nice. He's dead. <laughs> that was amazing. Ah, oh, that was really, really simple as well. Okay, very, very nice. Love it. And now we're done. Now we're done with that. And look at that. That is amazing. I'm very surprised that we were actually able to do it so so simply. But anyway, um, I'm, I'm actually going to go for max HP, I think, because giving me gold is basically useless. Uh, yeah, because it's going to only give me 500. Is that worth it, though? It will give me 500 because obviously they take 50%. Is that worth it in comparison to 10 HP? I don't know. Mm, it might be worth it. Okay, I'm gonna go for the I'm gonna go for the 10 HP, and we're gonna restore ourselves a little bit. And obviously they took the cut. Look at look at how much they took. They took 867 gold. That's pretty crazy. Anyway, there we go. We actually have someone that is telling of our legend. And we gain 500 fame as a result of that, which is very nice indeed. So that is exactly what we're going to do. And I'm going to reveal a couple of extra items here. Maybe we're going to be able to buy some. <laughs> Not in a million years. Not in a million years. I might be able to get the spiked club. Which might be cool. I mean, uh, the range on it is very limited. Kind of surprising that the range is limited because the model itself seems really quite long, but apparently, uh, apparently not. All right. Uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's basically. Wait a minute. Is it the same? No, it, it does more damage. Okay. Yeah. You know what? Let's um. Uh, now I'm wondering what I should do about this. Should I? Should I re-roll? I could re-roll and try to get a two-handed sword. Or I could trade for money. I could also spend 500 gold here. I could trade for money. I think I'll probably trade fame for money. Uh, we're already going to train. And I'm going to get one-handed axes again, I guess. Because that's that's what I'm going to get. I mean, I, you know, I think that's kind of... That's kind of useful, I suppose. So I think, yeah. I think we're going to do that. So let me see. We're going to trade some money. So we'll, um, we'll trade some fame for money. And we're going to get, yeah, that, yeah, as I say, I feel like this is not even worth it at this point because we're literally, I mean, look, they, they took 275 gold from me and I only, only got, you know, 400 or whatever. So that is, uh, that is really bad. Actually, I only got 300. Anyway, mm, I'm wondering what we want to do. Do we want to train in something else? I don't think think so. I could invest in my next character, but I don't think I'm going to die. Maybe I'm going to die. I'm not entirely sure, but I'm not going to re-roll right now. I'm not going to unlock anything else, and we're just going to go on to the next one. All right, I'm going to reveal a couple of things about this. Alawora or Maza. We could do either one. It's a many versus many. What are we fighting against? Pit slaves and criminals, and what else do we have against... Oh, we have civilians on the other side. I think we're probably going to go for this one, because this provides us with the ability to fight against easier opponents. And also, this is level 2. This is level 1, but this is level 2. And I'm I'm liking the prestigious thing, you see. I'm liking the prestigious thing, because 10% of the gold reward is invested in your next character. I think that's kind of good. So, um, we could do some betting as well. Let me actually just have a look at the bet. Oh, it pays out a massive amount. Deal 300 damage to teammates? Are you serious? <laughs> no. Uh, get three dismemberment. End with minus 20 public fa- Oh, you know what? <laughs> All of these bets seem very difficult to accomplish. I'm not going to do any of those. I think that that is uh, a bit too difficult for me, but maybe it's going to be good for you. Who knows? Who knows? Anyway, let's see what kind of arena we're going to get. I was actually really liking the one that had the moving central area. I think that was actually a lot of fun. But whatever the case, I have my two-handed. Two two -handed. I have my one-handed axe here. And I'm, uh, I'm kind of optimistic about this, but not 
that optimistic. Okay, um, my people are attacking each other. That's not very good. Oh, nice damage already. Oh, oh, that was great. Nice. Okay, I'm just trying to do some quick damage to these guys right here. Just to try and make sure that we get a little bit... Oh, <laughs> the damage. The damage is crazy. Okay, kill him. Kill him. I want his two-handed sword. I want to pick up his two-handed sword, please. Can I get it? Oh, I'm doing so much damage to this guy. He has no idea. He has no idea what is about to befall him. Apart from a one-handed axe that is chopping him into pieces. Yes, give me that two-handed. Can I pick it up? Yes, I can. There we go. Oh, you... Are you sir? He just hit me. Did you see that? He literally just hit me. Okay, that was terrible. Oh, well, never mind. I guess... I guess... I, I, it's fine. It's fine. You know, we're gonna... We're, we're, we're gonna do all right. Okay, I'm gonna have to be a bit careful here. Okay, is he dead? No. Almost. I think he's almost dead. I'm gonna run over here and help this guy. Okay, is he dead? No, he's not dead. Almost. Ah. Oh. oh, yes, there we go. He's dead. Nice. Oh, he's dead too. Okay. Whew. Nice. Okay, I think we're good. Oh, is this guy running? <laughs> no, he's not running. He's trying to kill me. How dare you? Okay, I've taken some pretty significant damage in this one, which is kind of bad. But um, I've actually gotten a bit better at blocking. I don't know whether you've noticed that, but generally, whenever you see the shield, someone actually mentioned that in the comments, whenever you see the shield uh, over your uh, cursor, basically where your cursor is, then that means you're successfully blocking against uh, whatever attack is incoming. So that's pretty cool. Anyway, there we go. We uh, we did not bad, uh, you know. All right, you know. We did level up as well, so that's nice. Oh, <gasps> two free physician treatments. I will take that immediately. Thank you very much. That's that's absolutely perfect. Oh, this is very bad though. I must rest and recover. Yes. Training and all related activities are unavailable. Scholar upgrades are unavailable. No, are you serious? Oh, that is terrible. Oh, well, never mind, never mind. Uh, let's see if we can get a shield, actually. A shield might be really useful. Where's my axe? Did my axe get destroyed? I thought I thought I still had it. Oh, okay. Uh, apparently something happened with it, but whatever the case, we can heal ourselves. So that's exactly what we're going to do. This is all free. So that's fantastic. Unfortunately, the next one will now cost me 1500 which is way too expensive. So I'm not sure how I'm supposed to do anything with that. Training is unavailable, as you can see, which is sad. I'm thinking, you know what? Maybe I'm thinking that we uh, start investing a little bit of money in my next character. I'm thinking maybe we're going to... We might perish. Let's put another little bit in there. Uh, yeah, we can trade some... Fame? Let's trade 2,000 fame even though... Oh, can I not do that? I can't do that? Oh, okay. <laughs> I don't know why I can't do that, but uh, maybe I missed something. Maybe there was something that actually happened and, you, you know, uh, yeah, maybe something happened. Oh, well, whatever the case, I'm going to reroll because we need a weapon. Give me a weapon. Give me a two-handed, please. Oh, we're getting some nice things, actually. That is a nice one-handed. Whoa, that looks cool. That looks like a cool weapon. Um, unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to use it because it is very expensive, as you can see right there. I might actually want to put a hold on this because it seems kind of fun. Uh, oh, no, actually, never mind. It only has 39 durability. That is a little bit too harsh for my liking. Uh, what about this? Aspirant straps might want to buy that. Oh, I can't buy I can't buy both. So I'm just going to buy this because that's the only thing I can buy. And then we're going to actually hold this, in my opinion. This is a pretty decent one. We don't actually have a chess piece right now. So I'm thinking this is going to be good. Let's hold that. All right. Uh, yeah, I think I'm pretty good. I think we can probably continue onward. Can we return to the armory after coming here? Yes, we can. Okay, so that's good to know. So in other words... Once you check what kind of battles you're going to be fighting, then you don't have to worry so much about what's going on. You know, you can kind of, you know, take your time with uh, selecting whether you actually buy a weapon or not. So technically you don't have to buy a weapon. Oh, this is a wild card. Okay. Okay. 
Wow. Um, what are we actually... <laughs> okay, these guys are... Uh, some of these guys are actually pretty harsh. There's a group with three pit mace men here. They're going to be very difficult to deal with, but maybe we want to do that instead of the level six. Yeah. I mean, the level six one seems extremely difficult. It is many versus one level plus three. So in other words, our level plus three. That's, I think that's too, I think that's too difficult potentially. I don't know. Let's have a look at the betting. Oh, I actually can't even bet anything anyway. I don't I only have 225 gold. So yeah, we'll go for, should I go for, you know what? No, you know what? I, I'm not going to go for that one. We're going to go for, we're going to go for this one. I'm going to change my mind last, last second. If it, if it messes up, then that's just how it is. We'll learn. All right. We'll learn. And then we'll, we can make better decisions in the in the future. Because obviously, if you, you know, if you try this out and it turns out to be an absolutely awful mistake, then at the very least, it's a mistake that we're going to learn from. And then we'll be like, oh, you know what? I'm not going to do that many versus many versus one, you know, against a level six opponent, you know, something like that. You know, I think that's going to be a, a good learning experience. <laughs> good learning experience, he says, as he gets absolutely murdered soon. Okay, there we go. Did some damage. Did some nice damage once again. Oh, yes. Good damage. Good damage. Can we please not get killed by him? Okay, not too bad. Okay, he's dead. There we go. That was very easy. I like it. And the audience loves my new weapon, apparently. Very nice. All right, so we gained a, a pretty significant amount of rewards. Unfortunately, the uh, the problem is that um, they, they take all my money, of course. That, that is the main issue here. All right, there we go. Okay, so we're going to recover a little bit. The items you've asked... That, yeah, okay, so yeah, he obviously held that, which is great. I gained an Iron Falchion from the Adoring Fan. Ooh, I like it. Yes. Oh, now that's a that's a wonderful weapon. Look at that. I can literally sell this for 1300 if I wanted to, but I had this saved. That I don't need that. I don't need that anymore technically. Uh I actually I didn't have that saved. I had this saved. So I'm actually going to buy the chest piece because that's that's really good because I don't know whether you've noticed, but it actually provides me with a fame multiplier and I kind of feel like getting more fame might actually be a really good idea. So we're just going to swap these around. I'm going to keep the axe because you never know. Maybe it's going to be kind of useful in the future. And let me actually just take a quick look here. So it's going to it's going to cost me 500 gold to heal. And I would like to get some training in. So what we're going to do is I'm going to... Hmm, this is, this is a bit... Uh, yeah, I don't think this is going to work. I'm going to have to reduce this quite a bit. Uh, yeah, this is kind of sad, isn't it? Yeah, this is kind of sad. All right, let me see. We're going to do 2,000. Mm. I just got four. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. It's, it's, a, it's a harsh life, isn't it? Yes, it is a harsh life. Okay, so we're not going to be able to do anything with this. I, I, can't, even, I can't even get anything here for training or anything. So that's, that's really sad. Oh, well, never mind. Uh, we, but we do have 150 to be able to reveal something. So this is a one versus one. I suppose I will reveal that or I will re reveal this. This is a many versus one. Okay, I like the many versus one. So I'm probably going to do that. I have my new weapon, which as you can see, I don't know whether you notice, but this is a great weapon. Look at it. It's got a really nice range to it. I'm very much looking forward to using this. Okay. Uh, so let's do it. Let's go into uh, let's go into this first one and see what we can do. I think this might actually be the uh, the longest that I've. Oh no, let me not uh, let me not jinx myself. I'm already jinxing myself. What do you bet? What do you bet that we actually die here? Just because I've said this is the longest I've actually survived. Yes. What do you bet? Hmm. We'll see. We'll see. Maybe maybe it's going to go bad. But I actually have a little bit more of a. You know, a little bit more of a positive outlook on things, because I, you know, I don't actually think I'm gonna die that quickly, but who knows? All right, here we go. 
Oh, you. <laughs> I, I really wanted to get him right there, but oh well. He's he's being very um he's being very uh, fidgety. I, I guess you could kind of call it, isn't he? I hit my own guy. Well, that's not very good, is it? There we go. I hit him now. Fifteen damage. Oh, that is oh that was massive damage right there. Unfortunately, he blocked that one. I don't want my weapon to be destroyed, actually. So I'm actually going to just disengage a little bit here. And then we're going to go back in. Nice. Oh, <laughs> that damage. Can we get him? Oh, no, no, no. Can we uh, can we get away from him, actually? I don't really want to fight him any further. I'd like to just... I, I want to try and keep my, uh, keep my weapon in good... Oh, he's dead. He is so dead. This weapon is amazing. Love it. All right, there you go. We actually did a pretty decent job right there. I don't even know what the reward was, but as you can see, it seems pretty okay. Uh, not amazing, but yeah, we were actually against a... Uh, what were we against? A, a, a level... Oh, we actually leveled up twice. Did we level up twice? All bracket levels below your rank have increased to four. And we have one free repair. Yeah, I don't need the free repair, actually. So I'm going to be taking the fame increase. That's 2,000 fame increase right there. That's kind of amazing. And there we go. We are now having a, <laughs> a citywide festival. Oh, dear. Yeah, this week, all matches yield minus 50% fame. Yeah, that's kind of harsh. It's because Mazza doesn't like me. That's the reason why that's happening, I assume. Uh, what else do we have going on here? We have a one-handed sword, which is kind of terrible. Uh, I Wow, this is an amazing sword. Look at the durability on it. It's still got an amazing amount left. So I'm very pleased about that. Maybe we want to... We're gonna... Uh, yeah, we obviously want to do training, right? We obviously want to do training. So let me do one-handed swords. And let's go for maximum. And we'll go stamina, one-handed swords. And then we're just gonna do a whole bunch. Hopefully I have enough. Yes, I do. Uh, I could technically get... Extraordinary, so significant less, significantly less chance to get ordinary items. But this... Oh, this is an adequate item. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure whether I want to do that, really. Yeah. Mm. Okay. That's the thing. If I spend 2,000 here, maybe it's not going to go very well. I, I don't know. Maybe it's not going to go very well. It very much depends. But the training is going to be very good, at least. And I would like to trade 1,000 gold. 1,000, not 1,000 gold. 1,000 fame. Because I want to heal myself once again. And that is enough to heal me to full HP. Fantastic. Look at that. That actually worked out really nicely. And I think what we're going to do is I might put in a shop order. Or hmm, do I want to do that? Or maybe we want to just re-roll, open, open another inventory slot. Another inventory slot, I suppose. And then, well, then it's the next, next, next battle. But... I'm actually going to end this episode off here. And uh, we're doing pretty nicely. I think we might be able to go super far with this particular character. Surprisingly enough. Anyway, I thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you next time.